All right, welcome to lesson one, sequences. A sequence is any ordered list of numbers. So as simple as one, two, three, four, and so on. I could also skip numbers, like 5, 10, 15, 20, or they could maybe the sequence will go backwards. 10, 8, 6, 4. Now the numbers in a sequence are called terms. We don't really call them numbers. So in the top one, the fourth term is 4. In this one, the fourth term is 20. And in the last one, the fourth term is 4 once again. And sequences also have a pattern. And if you could find that pattern, then you could find out where the numbers are going to keep continuing to go to. On number six in your homework tonight on the reteaching, you have a sequence that is not finished, and you have to describe the rule for it. So 18, 16, 14, blank, blank, blank. And then it says the rule is count blank by blank. You might be recognizing what the answers are already. It's pretty simple, but I want to warn you that they're going to get much more complicated. The fact that you recognized maybe already that the numbers are going down is a smart thing. You realize that you probably have to subtract, or maybe even when they're more complicated, divide. And if the numbers are going up, you're probably going to need to add, or maybe when they get more complicated, multiply. Sometimes it's a combination of both. Okay? This one is going down. So let's write that already. It's counting down. Now, it's counting down by how many? To do that, you want to find out what's the space in between each one. And you don't want to count the number first. You want to count what's in between. So let's go ahead and put the 18 in your head, 18, 17, 16. There's two in between. Test that. It's important to test your rule because it might work on the first one and not on the second one. That means you're, you have something wrong with your rule. You need to try again. 16, 15, 14. Two again, our rule worked twice, it's probably correct if it keeps working like that. So count down two more, 14, 13, 12, 12, 11, 10, 10, 9, 8. You can even check it backwards if you want, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, it's going down by two. So number six in your reteach is done, and now you know all about sequences and the terms that are inside them and the rules on how to find out how the sequence gets finished. Thank you.